We've got three ultra thin cases here from case manufacturer Totally's signature collection, which they say are made to fit the entire new Galaxy S10 range. That's the Galaxy S10, the Galaxy S10 Plus, and the Galaxy S10e, or they'll give you your money back. That's right, there's gonna be three new Galaxy S10 models at launch. Here's a quick rundown of what we expect the new Samsung Galaxy S10 range to look like when it's released on February the 20th. The first is this, the Samsung Galaxy S10e. This is a potential case for that phone, giving us an idea of the size and of the basic design. We're expecting the S10e to have a 5.8 inch screen. A cutout on the back here tells us it's probably going to have a two camera lens array. And a large cutout on the side here, well that probably shows this is gonna have a side mounted fingerprint sensor. Moving on from that, this case probably shows us the Galaxy S10's design. And it's a little bit different to the Galaxy S10e. This time, it's going to have a 6.1 inch screen. And this wider cutout for the camera lenses on the back indicates we should expect three camera lenses. The screen will have a hole punch in the top corner instead of a notch, giving it a very clean modern look. And we should also look out for some really thin bezels on the Galaxy S10. Finally, there's the Galaxy S10 Plus. This case, again, gives us a look at what could be the design of the Galaxy S10. It's larger than the Galaxy S10. It's 6.4 inch screen is what we're expecting on this phone. And again, the camera lens cut out on the back will probably replicate the same three lens camera array seen on the Galaxy S10. The difference here will be that the Plus model has another hole punch cut out, but with two camera lenses one of which could be a 3D sensor, if we believe all those rumors. So those are the three potential designs for the Samsung Galaxy S10 coming on February the 20th. 